did you know that the village of Orisara was first mentioned in the year 1464 under the name of Orisara? Travelers who sail the sea can visit Orisara via the harbor situated on the islet of Illico, which is near to the center of Orisara. Throughout the whole world, only Orisara can be proud of the unique football stadium, which has an old oak tree right in its center. The non-profit organization Saarema Sõjavara Selts, meaning the Military Equipment Museum, was first created in the year 2007. Its main output is collecting, studying, preserving and exhibiting the heritage of war history. The main collection of the organization is built up from the founding members' private collections. There are altogether about 12,000 exhibits. The Marsilin Order Castle, which is in German Zonaburg, was built in 1345 after the destruction of the Böide Castle and became the Livonian Order's new stronghold in Saarema. The castle was considered a punishment to the islanders. This is the origin of the German name Zonaburg, which means a castle of punishment. Marsilin is in ruins since 1576 when the Danish king Frederick II commanded to blow it up. The Pulli Glyph gives an opportunity to glance at the ground layers of Saarema. In order to find a way to the cliff, however, you need to search and adventure a little. The construction of the Yani church, which is situated on the Orisare Lazy Road, began in 1675. It was originally intended for the lepers. St. Mary's Lutheran Church in Böide was built in the beginning of the 13th century. This Romanesque and Gothic style church was one of the first stone buildings in Estonia and it is also one of the biggest churches in Saarema. On the northern side of the church one can still witness the ruins of the Order Castle that was destroyed during the St. George's Night Uprisings of 1343. At Otti Manor, which is in German Boidehof, a German writer and poet Walter Flex was killed in 1917. One of his most well-known novels is The Wanderer Between the Two Worlds. During the World War I, Flex fought on the side of Germans as a reserve lieutenant. The Aderkais burial chapel was built in 1791 for the families of the three nobility officers von Aderkas, von Berg and von Burmeister. The construction of the Estonian Apostolic Orthodox Church in Tornima was completed in 1873 and the church was dedicated to the protection of the Virgin Mary. Kõrkvere Avakivi is one of Saarema's greatest boulders. It is 4.3 meters in height and 26.5 meters in diameter. The church of Valjala is considered the oldest stone church in the provinces of Estonia. This church holds a Romanesque baptismal font, which is a unique piece of stonework in Estonia and across the Baltic region.
Despite the fact that in year 1227 the order's forces could not conquer the stronghold of Vallala or Castrum Valdea, the islanders nevertheless had to convert to Christianity. Nowadays people celebrate St. John's Eve or Jani Laupäev in the ancient stronghold. A legend tells that Piratikivi or Pirat Stone fell from the apron of Saarema's ancient heroine Pirat when she was carrying heater stones for building the sauna. This particular stone had painfully fallen onto her toes and from the tears of the crying Pirat, a swamp called Naistaso or Women's Swamp emerged. Near Saaregula village, Duke Gregorio raised stone altar to the honor of mystic goddess Plesta and the northern civilization. The duke claimed to be a representative of the so-called Abali order. Unfortunately, nobody else knows of the goddess Plesta, the Abali order or the great northern civilization, except for the duke himself. The Saaregula nature trail is an about two kilometers long nature education trail, which is passable with a baby carriage as well as on a bicycle. The 24 meters high Laidun in a lighthouse has actually been used as a lightless daily signal. According to a tale, a Saristera construction foreman had mixed up the locations. The correct construction site should have been Kybasare instead of Laidunina. The beautiful brick lighthouse, together with its many outbuildings on the eastern coast of the island of Saarema, was built in 1907. This remarkable piece of architecture, with fine Dolomite detailing, is listed as an architectural monument.